Welcome to Tuesday Night uh, Shatter and Shenanigans. I'm Bob Loper, your GM, and we are continuing uh, the beginning of Season 7 with uh, 0701, The Duck Job. Uh, so previously on Shatter and Missions, uh, our new team uh, has been hired uh, by Maggie Goldberg to, uh, to recover a stolen prototype cyber deck that was uh, stolen during a a daring heist in the middle of traffic uh, that involved uh, the releasing of pigs from a cargo truck. Um, so some thieving wrath scallion stuff was going on, and uh, what our team found was that uh, the gang responsible for it was called the Frenemies. Uh, they wear uh, blue and gray, and they hang out at a. Uh, at a little dive bar just outside the CZ uh, that is called Right Now. So they did some recon of the place. Oh, you could have said more on that later. That would have been that would have been good. We'll we'll take it again. Take it from the top and action. <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, we're dying this season. Yeah. Yes, we're we're, uh, we're about thirty seconds from skipping to the end of the season, where uh, we have a TPK. <laughs> hey. <laughs> what did you just? Do? Anyway, it's been really, really great being here. Uh, so our, our team did some recon. Uh, I believe there's at least one. I think there's a Kambushi drone still in there. Mm -hmm. um, and a Noisquito. And a Noisquito. Mm -hmm. uh, there was some. Uh, some talk of killing all these dudes. <laughs> uh, but what they did find out was that uh, there were four of them there before, and they waited long enough uh, that the fifth one walked in, saying, I made the sale. So now we oh, pick yeah. up with our intrepid runners. All it right, is now eleven thirty Friday night. Time to so, go. Uh, or or, or eleven thirty Saturday morning, depending on what what tech throws up. <laughs> we need to find out who that guy made the sale to. Uh, yeah. If you all would stop talking, I could listen. Yeah, she gets spicy when she hasn't eaten. I told you to grab something while we were mm -hmm. there. Mm-hmm. I pull out my gun and I'm ready. Alrighty. <laughs> okay. Um, who? I don't know, but I'm ready. I... Uh, so this guy goes over uh, to the table and they all sort of pull out comm links and they all, uh, the, the guy that just walked in pulls out a cred stick and they do the, the whole you touch your cred stick to your comm link and transfer some money. So they're basically splitting up the funds from that cred stick. Erica, you and I, I to the page. I just, I was fine, and then I looked at Amber. Dom! So where did that money come from? <clears throat> no, I'm asking um, Fiona. Yeah. Uh, so they're not having so, so, a conversation about I it. I mean, they're, they're they're, just, no, they're, they're, not, they're not laying out their full evil plan in front of the camera. Because they've already done it. <laughs> um, okay, cool. At this point, they're this they're just grabbing drinks, turn up the music, and uh, dealing cards. All right. Okay. So. Uh, do I need to go back in? Certainly, you 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 do notice that the or you did notice on the cameras that the guy who walked in uh, did lock the door. Okay. Alrighty. All right. So uh, yeah. Do, do I need to just go back in there? Probably probably not a good idea. Right. Because I, I can mean, just go back maybe, in there. No, maybe we try searching um, maybe the uh, seeing if there were any, like, I don't know. <laughs> what are the, the, what's the uh, shadow uh, Watch your head a little bit. Forum. Uh, uh, yeah, as, as you guys are talking back and forth, he just like, makes note that uh, you should probably watch your head a little bit, and he uh, he's going to activate the remote turret on uh, on his truck. Okay, so, so, uh, so, so you guys see this uh, this turret pops up out of the top of the SUV, and the the um, 
the emitter barrel for a for an Ares uh, Archon laser cannon pops out. I mean, we don't have to blow up the whole place and like murder them all. I'm just saying, like, I can get us all back in there. One of those guys is like criminal interested in me, so. So the guy is criminally interested in you, and you want to go back in there? Yeah, like he could go to jail for being this interested in me. I can just go back in there. You're... Uh, okay. Um, that's a new one. Criminal right. interest. Yeah, no, and you can be like... my two friends that I brought with me, and then we'll go in and just pow, 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 take the one, and then. I don't know. You're military, right? Yeah, yeah no, this is how I handle it. So going you can, in anywhere going so you pow, can, pow, pow. but you have like knowledge of how to interrogate. Oh, interrogation was definitely not my field. Yeah, but, uh, I, I drive I things. Tech would be my thing. Um, so I can try to see if I can find anything. You don't have um, any kind of training on interrogation. The, I mean, yeah, I have some training on interrogation, but like I never need to use it because I'm always in the matrix. Well, I mean, I don't know who. But so, do you have like a tech way to get the info that we need? Is it possible, Bob, to, like, see if there was whatever, like, dark Craigslist is, um, to see if they posted <laughs> the dark net? <laughs> no, it's definitely, it's definitely Craigslist. So, dark so there is, there is the equivalent, Craigslist. there's essentially a matrix search that you could do. Yeah, I want to um, do a matrix or, search to see if I can find. Or your, your best bet at this point is Probably like matrix wise to just hack one of their com links. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna hack the the dude that came in saying he did the thing. Okay. And I will do that using hold on, I got this. Hold on. Okay. Mm, is it hacking with intuition? So you're gonna are you hacking on the fly or are you doing a brute force? Hmm. I get a bonus to hacking on the fly, don't I? Uh -huh. No. Because <laughs> I don't have that equipped. I don't have exploit equipped. Oh, wait. But if I'm just now turning it on, I can. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Boom. Um, and I believe you also have the... the code slinger quality. Which gives you two dice on hack on the fly. Uh, amazing. Okay, so that means I get. I guess Craigslist is already the dark net in real life. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. Uh. <clears throat> mm. Uh, I'm going to. Okay, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna have exploit active. I'm going to. I'm going to actually turn off baby monitor so I can do exploit. Ooh. Okay. Um, for now. Okay. Brave. I know, I know. It's really brave of you. No, I'm going to do signal scrub instead. I'm 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 trading out signal scrub for exploit. And so there is there is to... there is some noise here, uh, but it's covered by your vectored signal filter. Mm. There, there's only uh, two points of noise right now. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to acquire a, a target with my noise keto. Okay. So uh, I. So, so do a do a uh, I believe it's a clear sight plus pilot. Okay. So roll that many okay. dice. Is it hacking plus intuition? It plus, is hack, hacking plus logic plus two. Hacking plus logic plus two. Boop. And I will roll his intuition plus firewall. Uh, his intuition. That's a shame. It's a three. That's a four. Okay, so. So you said the clear side is a pilot plus a clear side? So pilot plus clear side, yeah. And plus another six dice, okay. 
Uh, so you have Mark on the uh, on the uh, com link. Amazing. Um, hackety hackety. More. Uh, so now you can do a you know matrix perception test. And see what's on it. Okay, so you you think you have acquired is that perception uh, and logic? Uh, it is computer plus intuition. That makes way more sense. Okay. Uh, yeah. So there are some files on here. Um, you can kind of get uh, what his movements were. Um, and you get a name, Aaron Spencer. Mm. And you could tell he was trying to hide that, but not very well. Okay. Um, we're looking for an, uh, an Aaron Spencer, it looks like. Like one of those guys is named Aaron? Um, let's see if I can pull up some so sort of photo ID. Uh, you'll need to this do guy. another... So, so you've targeted this guy? Um... Uh, is that I... what I heard? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, Frodo, right. what are you what are you doing with the what are you doing? I'm just my job, and uh, he's the, he's now like rolling the the truck backwards slowly. Uh, I got us some information. Okay, you keep doing that. Yep. Oh, all right. I work faster. <laughs> <laughs> Did I just go in there? <laughs> I mean, no one's gonna have to go in there in a minute, but if, if you'd like to, go ahead. I'm trying to find this information before he. I'm certain they're. Uh, I'm certain laser. they're gonna come out. In, I in a moment. grab the back of his shirt collar and shake him a little, and I say, "Don't you dare fucking kill me inside." Huh? No, but, you're, kill you. but, but you're jumped in, right? Yes. Yeah, so, so you, I guess you, you are just I'm just you doing... ragdoll him and he's just he's just ragdoll as you shake him. <laughs> and then I yell louder in his ear, Don't kill me. I and mean I you, get you, out you hear that you hear that through the, the microphones inside the vehicle. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. yeah uh, uh, obviously and then like I so, put like a so little bit like friendly. <laughs> so you step out. Yeah, I get out, and then I go back to the front door to go meet my fate with this creepo. All right. <laughs> so we'll put you there, and then uh, go ahead and make uh, feedback a uh, matrix search. So this is computer plus into. Uh, oh, sorry, uh, matrix perception. This is uh, computer plus intuition. Oh. Uh, yeah, Ooh. I'm gonna... <laughs> it's not not quite a glitch, but... I'm gonna post it. Wait, post edge? Yeah. Yeah, you can you can post edge to uh, re-roll. Well, just re-roll what you rolled. Yep. Because everything yeah. was a failure. No, yeah, we got that. Um, <laughs> there's no way that can happen twice, right? Whew. <sighs> okay. <laughs> It's fine. So yeah, you, you uh, do pick up a uh, a photo of Aaron Spencer, so I will give you that picture. And then do I know if that... Wait, we know who's in the... We know Aaron Spencer is not in the room, right? Because we I have right. their names. Well, well now, now that you... Yeah, you have, you have the, the names they went by, and now that you yeah. have a picture of Aaron Spencer, it is confirmed he is not among those guys. Cool. Then I'm not going in there to subject myself to this horse. So, so uh, it's time for uh, 
for Frodo. Can I hack his laser? <laughs> not not fast enough to stop what's about to happen. Dang it. <laughs> but but there's a whole host of fun that can be had, De so Decker on Rigor. <laughs> I mean, we're <laughs> twins, like, yeah, it's fully gonna happen someday. <laughs> Look, I find out Aaron Spencer's not in there, and I'm gonna go back to the car. Yeah, I do send, like, the image to you guys. So, so they don't need to die now? Is, so that, is, is that what you're saying? So are you firing the weapon? We don't have to do anything with these people. Okay. You're the one that said that everybody had to die. I like that you listened to me. I mean, I'm not I'm, I'm <laughs> not nice. I'm, I'm this is not a nice change. It's really good. Okay. Well. All right. Let's not attack Kendall. Um, he's not here. <laughs> Uh, this, the the computer poor, poor. twin. Uh, so just then, a no, uh, an no. advert, an AR ad comes over uh, the Matrix. Uh, that's the uh, the promo for the new adventures of Billy Berserker. Oh, sweet! And uh, I guess he just pulls up a screen in uh, in the Matrix and starts watching. Uh, he starts looking for the the newest episode. Well, there, there are no episodes of this show yet because it's it's coming soon. Tom, oh. did you make a poll? <sighs> Wait, what's the poll? Yeah, yeah, he did. Uh, Fiona, can you ping his last uh, several GPS P? coordinates or P? Yeah, yeah. Um, can do. Ping whose last? Aaron. Spencer's? Uh, so you don't have columns this... on Aaron Spencer? No, no, this, uh, the one that we got the info from. The one oh, we... got it. Yeah, that guy. The bad guy. He's the friend of me. He's Jax, right? Uh, actually, uh, Tommy Boy. Tommy Boy. Okay. I think I might, I might have said Jax before, but, but I'll, I'll go with Tommy the Tommy Boy made though. a deal. It's Tommy awesome. Boy made a deal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I want to ping his last location then, yeah. I want to laugh because Chris is laughing. Why are you laughing, Chris? Me? Yeah. Have you met me? Yeah, no, you're right. <laughs> That's my bad. Okay, is that a, is that another? No, uh, so you have, you have enough of, uh, enough of info on his comm that you, uh, can just do it pretty easily. You, you know that his last known location was uh, uh, so there's a park inside the CZ. Mm, I send the coordinates uh, to Frodo. Alrighty. Uh, Put away yeah. the laser and drive. Yeah, 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 ma. And then like, it starts coming down. Ooh. So, so, uh, so, so what's next? Like, what's the plan? We get uh, here. We find Aaron Spencer, get back the tech, and then call it a day. Go get paid. So, what are are, are we are we using like our wiles and uh, to to get to get the thing, or are we kicking in the door, or are you guys kicking in the door? I don't think there's a need to be too specific. I mean, just like. It'll limit your options if you have a specific plan. If That's you've... not how plans work. I don't know about that. Get in the door, I got you. I mean, people have yeah. ideas of goals. <laughs> I, think, I, I think that if you just don't have expectations, everything's better. You can see that. Are you okay? Just go where the wind blows. He's just a sick in the butt. Don't listen to her, Kate. Are you all right? Yeah. Are you... Mm. Okay. I just used to be part of a group that like did too much planning, and <laughs> I just, you know. I got you. Yeah, I got you. It's amazing. Oh, kind of all talk uh, and action. 
uh, I will say, uh, I will say though, uh, I'll pick a, a corner that's like a block away. If things go south and and I have to bug out, I'll, I'll pick you up. I'll have something pick you up here. You'll have something pick us up here. Yeah, uh, and then I, I start to mobilize the universe. Cool. You're having it meet you at the park. Is that what I heard? Or? Uh, I'm gonna have it. I'm gonna have it at like a uh, a corner, like a block away, like uh, to the north, and then okay. uh, in case in case we need to split up or whatever, no it's, one gets it's like the not wanting people to see your parents drop you off at school, so they drop you off. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Wasn't it so embarrassing? They kept fucking like singing little Hobbit songs whenever we all jumped out at the same time. Like, no, hi ho, hi ho, off to school we do not go. No. I'll be off around the corner, and I'll make my own way, Ma, thanks. Okay, so uh, so then you pull up at the park. And so by now it is, uh, we'll call it uh, 0100 Saturday. Okay. Remember, you have, a, you have an 8 a.m. Monday deadline. Okay. They're not that worried. We'll be fine. This is the last thing we got to do. I don't know what we're going to do for the rest of the stream time. I got Jackbox games. You guys want to play Jackbox games? Finish so this mission first before we talk about which <laughs> Jackbox game we want to play. Oh. Okay, so we're like, at the you park. You got to watch her. She likes to cheat, though. I'm just saying. Yeah. So you pull up to the park, and uh, because it's 1 a.m., uh, the park is empty. Yeah, that tracks. Uh, there's some buildings in the distance. Uh, I mean, it's not that big a park. Uh, but you get the sense it's this park is a convenient public place to hold a meet that is not anywhere near anyone's hideout. Um... Are you able to work your computer magic again? Um, I look around for cameras. Um, you do find some cameras. Okay. Um, uh, I want to. Are they the kind that? What kind of cameras? <laughs> Um, basic surveillance cameras, uh, CCTV. Hmm. So it wouldn't tell me what happened, not in real time. Maybe, it... depending on what's what's there. All right, I'll check them out and see if it okay. has any recorded data. Um, that's a hack. Yes, yeah, so you can do a uh, you can do a hack, uh, hacking plus logic. So uh, I have a uh, if you're kicking in a door, I have a uh, a smart platform with an AK ninety seven. If if you want to take care of that with you, then I can fire uh, give you fire support. That's really you just got really so nice of you, Frodo. I'm just trying to help where I can. Have we traded uh contact yet? Like contacts information? Uh oh, we have not. You know, let me go ahead and ping you. And I All send right, him yeah. <laughs> I sent him my info. Oh, okay. And then I, I send it back. Uh yeah. Meanwhile, so, so, you, so you you so you ping, <laughs> so you ping this uh, this camera, uh, and the camera you ping does in fact have data that immediately downloads to your uh, to your deck uh, before it burns out. Amazing, cool. Um, I watch it. Okay, look and see if I can find this deal going down. Uh, yeah, so indeed, you do find the deal going down, uh, probably 
oh, I guess that would have been four or five hours ago, something like that. Mm. Uh, so you see Tommy Boy and uh, this guy, Aaron Spencer, uh, walk up. Uh, you also see a couple of other people um, sort of off to the side. It's like, you know, like Shadowrunners having a meet. Uh, so in particular, you see... Uh, I'll show you... This one. Okay. He looks and real cool. <laughs> she also looks real cool. <laughs> <laughs> and some real cool people here, guys. It can be unfortunate when we have to murder them. Okay. Oh, is this is this one we we're, we're getting hot? Is all I, I'm just watching the footage. I don't know what you guys are doing. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm hacking so, the camera. So, so, the, the, so the two females are sort of off to the side. They're they're really just sort of looking on to make sure this goes this this trade actually goes off. Mm -hmm. Um, want to stay in the car, Kea, or I can send a. Or you want to get okay, out? Everybody sit still. Quickly? Let me figure out what's on the, and then we can figure out. Yeah, what I you mean, guys can do, right? there's nowhere, there's nowhere for us to go right now. Just hang out. I'm gonna send like a little uh, uh, a noise key, you know, just to like listen to their conversation. Whose conversation? There's no one here. There's, there are two. two. On the That's video on footage. The it's on the video footage. Yeah. There's, there's, no one, there's no one in the park. Tracking. Never mind. Uh, yeah, never mind. A time traveling noise hedo. Mm hmm. <laughs> you got one of those? Uh, that would be uh, awesome. So you, so you do see. Um, so there's a handoff made. Uh, there's a. Uh, so uh, Spencer comes up, uh, looks at the package, uh, hands over a cred stick. Um, the uh, uh, Tommy Boy offers him a another small package, uh, as if to say, "Do you want to buy this?" Uh, and uh, Spencer declines. Hmm. Is is there an ability to zoom in on this footage? Uh, <laughs> Yeah, so you could do the, you, you do the you do the standard CSI and hands. Yeah. Enhance. Uh and there there are limits to what you can enhance. Um mm, that doesn't track with what I've seen. <laughs> uh so what what are you looking for? What are you what are you enhancing? I want to um See if I can get an idea of what this package is. If I to see if there are any more like clues or signs or whatever that's like this is what we're looking for. Uh, so with your enhance, um, the package that was exchanged is the package you're looking for. Okay. The package that was refused is has similar markings, but is not the package you're looking for. Okay. It looks like a, a chip case. Okay. Yeah. Like one of those, you have like a a multi pack of data chips. Hmm. Interesting. But not what we're looking for. It's not the mission. It is. It is not what you're looking for. Um. Yeah. So you for... you also did not. You also did not see Tommy Boy carrying it when he got back. Huh. Okay. I'm going to probably keep watching the footage and see if he, like, connected with someone else while he was in the park. So you're doing what now? Um, I won't, I'm going to keep watching to see if he connected with anyone else. No, so they uh, they both depart at that point, uh, yeah. and then it's just sort of random people walking through. Uh, you do catch a glimpse of a 
uh, of a dark panel van uh, that the that Spencer gets into. Uh, but you don't really catch plates on it. Okay. Okay. Um, all right, you two. Uh, four or five hours ago, um, it seems that Tommy Boy uh, sold the thing we're looking for um, to... Uh, was it DeSil or Laura so or someone else? The, the exchange was made to Aaron Spencer. To Aaron, yeah, no, that's right. DeSil um, and DeSil and Laura were the other two that were there. They were like witnessing the trade. Yeah, they were kind of uh, keeping lookout, like yeah, you know, like your shadow runners making a deal, and you, you don't trust the in person you're dealing south. with. Yeah, in case yeah. it goes south. Um, yeah, definitely. Um, sold it to Spencer. Uh. Also had like another weird thing that I don't remember seeing on him when we were back at the bar. Um like some data like a data chip case thing, but I don't know if we should be too worried about that. But definitely hand it off handed it off to Spencer. And it being in my notes. It being the uh the uh Wow, I wrote every description except for oh, yeah. what it was. <laughs> it, the missing item that needs to be recovered. Uh, so, it, so it is a box that is uh, has the marking, uh, has oh, labels. MCT uh, logo? It is, uh, has an MCT logo and a label L772008. Oh, 7-7. I'm so upset. Please zoom out. What? <laughs> D, D enhance. D enhance. <laughs> D enhance. L seven seven two zero zero eight. Yeah, L seven seven dash two zero zero eight. Okay. <clears throat> cool. Uh, yeah. Um, it's exchanged hands, so. I think our next step is probably to track down this uh, Aaron Spencer. Ernie, that is that is is that is that his legal son? Hmm. Uh, I it's don't know. Whatever he's using, it doesn't really matter as long as we can track down where he's at right now. I mean, well, yeah, that's yeah, that's what, that's what I mean. Yeah, so like uh, his house. Cool. Um, I'm gonna find my friend and see where uh, see where Aaron is. We're just gonna roll up, ask him for the thing, and we're all good. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Okay. <laughs> so, sounds like you'll be done by the mid-session break. Yeah, I think so. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. So uh, so we gotta find Spencer. Easy. Alrighty. Give me the coordinates, and I'll make my way. I do a matrix search. <laughs> okay. You may do a matrix search. It is computer, computer plus, in, yep. Uh, I still can't believe I got a zero on that comp one computer check I did. It's wild. On 11 dice. I know. <clears throat> Uh, okay, uh, so with five hits, let's see. Um, so there is a, uh, there is a legal or at least very good fake sin, uh, for Aaron Spencer. Mm -hmm. Uh, it, it goes back long enough that it's probably legal or really good fake, uh, because it includes history back to, uh, Aaron Spencer growing up in uh, in the CZ. Cool. Um, and so you get sort of a neighborhood where he, where he grew up. Um, 
there's some indication that he moved out east to work security for Megacorp. Um, but that's all you get unless you want to dig deeper. Yeah, I want to figure out if I can get, I don't know, like an address or something, a way to find him. So I will do that. Okay, so uh, roll uh, another matrix search at a minus one modifier. Right. Is there a way I can help her? Uh, you can do a similar search. Uh, okay. Uh, would you have me do, have me use a uh, computer? It, yeah, it's computer plus intuition. So you're you're essentially doing a teamwork test, which means mm. so you can give her five dice on her next test. Oh, cool. Uh, so you'll need to. Uh, so after the five dice bonus, uh, now you're going to make another test at a total of plus three instead of plus five. All right, so uh, after about a half hour, uh, so you find, um, so whatever happened uh, working security for Megacorp, uh, you don't see him on any of the public roles for that Megacorp anymore. Um, you do uh, get the sense that he's he's been uh, searching the area for something or someone. And uh, maybe he's moved back into, the, into that neighborhood. Uh, so you get a general area where he might be. Uh, you might have to narrow it down further with some actual legwork. Okay, awesome. Um, cool. I, yeah, I look at... But it, but, it is, like, but it is now nearly two in the morning on Saturday. Yeah. Uh, and you're not going to get a lot of like, work done at 2 a.m. It says you were speed running this. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to knock on every door in the neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, yeah. Or am so I, I just, dropping you I off, Kaya? You can pick up the search in the morning. Yeah. Or, or, or am I taking you? What time do you guys want to start in the morning? As That's early breakfast. as possible. Um, I usually get up around dawn. Well, and then I just kind of lay back in the seat and then close my eyes and I say, wake me up when you're ready. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, Not a so... bad idea. And you're, sl you're sleeping in for an army officer sleep until dawn. <laughs> 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 no way is that going to fly. <laughs> I go ahead and yeah, I catch some Z's. Uh, I do what I want. <laughs> yeah. Also not going to fly. <laughs> oh, well, I guess that's why I'm shadow running. <laughs> yeah. The, the real reason why you quit. <laughs> <laughs> Wake it up too early. So, 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 are, so are, are you getting dropped off somewhere or are you staying in the van too? Yeah. Yeah. You think you're going to stay in here? I'm just yeah, yeah, I'll yeah. Say, they, they, yeah, I'll they say. both basically just curl up in the I seat. Just, yeah, I was gonna say I'm gonna curl up in the passenger seat and just. Yeah, so uh, since we don't have yeah. a, a a concrete direction, uh, while, as yeah. I sleep, uh, get the general neighborhood. I do give you that. Okay. Uh, he, I was actually just gonna go ahead and take a just like a a cruise. He's gonna take like a little night cruise, and then he's gonna stop at like a. Which is what actually puts feet asleep. <laughs> <laughs> so uh he's gonna drive to like a a stuffer shack or or some uh somewhere to like grab like uh some coffee or some energy drinks um and some like uh you know like uh or i guess soy soy egg and cheese uh uh sandwiches or or, or night, faux bacon sandwiches yeah late night stuffers yeah and then he's gonna get ready for you know staking out and just 
chill in the car and whatnot. All right, so you stop at the Stuffer Shack and uh, drinking coffee and eating eating stuffers. Uh, I get I get uh, what I get two of uh, Fee's favorite because uh, I know she's gonna want to, uh, and then uh, I'll grab I'll just uh, grab uh, an extra one for uh, for Ko in case she wakes up and she's hungry. Okay. Uh, so is it, is it your intention to stay awake all night? Chris, hmm? are you going to stay up all night? Yes. Okay. Ah, oh, there it is. Sleep deprivation. <laughs> Sleep, Chris. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. You guys are asleep. You have no idea I'm not sleeping. <laughs> uh, so Can make I roll a to wake up. Go and make a body. Uh, go and make a body plus willpower test. What's my okay. twin intuition roll? Ooh, is there one? There is not. Uh, one. There I should be a going on. There should be. Come on. I mean, I'm down for it if you if you want. Like I mean, it, but you you could do I'm something cool like a, it, I'm cool with it. You could do something like like a judge intentions test. Uh, but since you are going to sleep, you'll take a minus four to that. Okay. Uh, I will use a smackdown. Hell no! <laughs> no! You don't do that! Don't do that! I'm not doing it then! I'm not doing it then! Okay, okay, no. fine, fine. Yeah, you're right. I'll, I'll roll it. Okay, so, so uh, body plus willpower? <laughs> Dang it. No, I was talking about the, I was just talking about for my, for my sleep deprivation test, not my oh, judge intentions. I thought uh, you hit the judge intentions. Oh, no, no. That, that that's is a, that, that's a, that's so, a fate thing. I'll talk so, about the body willpower test. Before before you go so far as to spend the smackdown, you're only resisting one stun. Oh, well, then never mind. With, with body plus willpower. Yeah. yeah, I'll just roll that. Okay. To be honest, you probably don't sleep a lot anyway. Yeah. No. We, yeah. yeah. yeah uh, actually, uh, as I think about it, let me let me make sure I, I might have made a mistake on that. Um... Because I think you might have. Did I give you a sleep regulator? Uh, I've got a respirator. Uh, calm link shop Bio automotive. For Bioware. Oh, okay. That's the wrong one. I have a ref two reflex recorders, data jack, uh, control rigs. Uh, do you have fatigue resistance? I did not. Okay. Do not have fatigue. All right. Resistance. I do. Oh, yeah. I so, do. let's see. At dawn, we'll call that 6.30 a.m. Did I say dawn? I meant uh, 5 Mid-morning? <laughs> I uh I play so, so, taps so you, on the so you, over the the speakers on the car. As she gets up, he's just holding a he's just holding a a sandwich and uh, and some orange juice or whatever. Uh, yeah, orange juice. Yeah. Yeah, having just woken up, she's a lot less uh, stuffy, um, and like, yeah, and she's just like ah. Oh. Thanks. And like start to eating and is like, did you sleep at all? Yeah, uh hey KO. <laughs> he like reaches back and just starts uh shaking her. You gotta sleep, man. You don't have to shake me, I'm up. Okay, damn. Well you <laughs> told me to wake you up when we're ready here. Here's a sandwich if you if you're hungry. I'm good, thank you. Let's get going. <gasps> You a machine or something? And he's just like he's eating a sandwich. And, uh, all right, so 
Go ahead you're and gonna, uh, narrow down your search. So you're going to head to that neighborhood. Yeah. Um, so you, you hit that neighborhood. It's probably about 7 o'clock by the time you get there. And are you actually going to start waking people up at 7 a.m. on a Saturday? Uh, yeah. Okay. Eventually they're going to start I... farting and stuff in my so car. Could I, cross -ref it? could I help by <laughs> cross-referencing, like, addresses? Yeah, there's got to be like an on narrow down. Some yeah, houses here. I don't think we need to actually go to people's doors. So you can do another matrix search. Okay. I will. Yeah, you said about, it like, a little menacingly. It's fine. <laughs> Alright. No, I can send and I wasn't gonna like knock on doors and wake people up. I was just like uh gonna send drones or something in their you house. Shoot your lasers then. Yeah, we get it. I mean, yeah. Have you seen that sh the the movie er the eraser? I'm trying to no. get my Arnold Schwarzenegger on. No. It's ripping through houses. It was great. <laughs> um, I'm now gonna rewrite movies. Um uh, and just make them with toddlers. So the eraser is now about a kindergartner who just goes around erasing answers from people's tests. Um, so you, uh, <laughs> you 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 search the area. You do find some cameras. Okay, cool. Um, and on that camera, I'm going to I'm going to look. I'm going to look at the camera. I'm gonna I'm gonna hack it. That'll be yep. That'll be hacking. I get a plus two to that. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. All right. Aaron Spencer. Why'd you roll again? Yeah, so so you uh, you log into these cameras, uh, you do get a mark, um, and uh, you're sort of scanning through um, the ones that that go back far enough. Uh, you do not see Aaron Spencer on. Mm. Okay. Uh... And you get you get the you, you get the sense from placement of cameras that uh, it is more about home security here and much less about surveillance. Yeah, for sure. Like like Do the all of the, the, the streets the area... have like a camera. Yeah, so they're they're well not streets, but you do see them on houses yeah. here and there. Yeah. Uh, okay. And in this neighborhood. By and large, most of the houses have set them up for security and apparently with the intent of avoiding doing surveillance. Interesting. So you see very few shots of, of the streets. Right. I guess I just want to just spend some time and maybe see if, uh, uh, Frodo, if you'll help me, like, just try to see if we can find through these cameras the a house that Aaron walked into. <laughs> okay. A house? Alrighty. Alright. Um, you take that half, and I'll take this half, and, uh... Alright, so, uh, odds, evens? Yeah, I got evens. Yeah. Alrighty. And then we do the thing. Uh, so you're just hacking, hacking... Like hacking... Warfare? You're hacking random security cameras. We're just going. We're taking. <laughs> we're taking all the cameras to try to find it. It feels better than waking people up at seven a.m. Yeah. Can I use electronic warfare instead of a computer? Uh, what? Uh, no. <laughs> okay. So electronic warfare is more for jamming and counter jamming. Okay. Gotcha. 
Yeah, to, to do what you're looking to do, you really need hacking. Oh, hacking? Okay. Yeah. I got that too. Which means you need you need either an attack or a sleeve attribute on a deck. That I do not. So then mm -hmm. I cannot help you. Yeah. All right. Uh, so instead, I'm going to. I'm going to do it myself, I guess. Form single major action with two targets of this program. Um, I'm going to equip. Fork. Okay. Will that help the time? I mean, yeah, if you're if you're just going down the road, boom, boom, hack, 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 you can do that. Yeah, I'm gonna do okay. that. I am gonna un unequip baby monitor for now because I don't think I need it to hack the cameras. I don't know. What we'll shadow? So, um, so I I will I will warn you um, that if you are doing this repetitive hack motion, mm. you you. Definitely need baby monitor equipped. Okay. I will keep baby monitor. Because you will. Because will... I can roll until you get converged on. Right. Uh... Okay. I'm going to keep baby monitor. But yeah. So baby monitor, you're, you're going to need for this. If, if, that's the, if that's the tactic you're taking. Okay. Um, I'm going to equip fork. Yep. This will be, all be hacking on the fly, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'll I'll have to get rid of stealth then, and that'll just take this down. By okay. One. Okay. Okay, and so how many hacking rolls do you want me to make? All of them. <laughs> uh, uh, so I believe fork allows you to do uh, two with one roll. Mm-hmm. Uh, so go ahead and start with that. Okay. Uh, then I'm going to need another one. Do I have to remove any dice, or can I just... Is it because they're different targets that it's fine? Uh, because they're different targets, and you're doing uh, hacks on different targets, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, so... Run through moves, KO. So your Overwatch oh, score... Not... You now have an Overwatch score of 7. Okay. What's the number that's bad? It's like 100, right? 40. Mm, okay. <laughs> yes, it's much, much lower than 100. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, I'm fine. Yes, Mr. Vimes is just like Carpal Tunnel. <laughs> uh, so, so with seven... The name of my first album. So with uh, seven, uh, mm -hmm. you do... Um, you find a... Uh, I mean, it takes you a while, but you're, you kind of hack one almost at random, and you do see, um, not at the street, but sort of, I mean, this, this camera's sort of looking down the row of houses, uh, and you do see, like, maybe two doors down, there's a, uh, there's a two-story uh, apartment building. It's got, uh, basically, it looks like it's got two doors in each level. Uh, and you do see uh, who you think is Aaron Spencer going up the stairs. Um, I point out the uh, the building and I go, that's the one you guys are going to want to go to. And by you guys, I mean Kale. <laughs> like you're you're part of the guys, right? <laughs> he looks. I uh, did. I did my deep. job. And, and by now it is uh, it is probably close to eight thirty a.m. on Saturday. Fee, do you know if he has roommates or any other people living with him? Uh, well, let me look. <laughs> That's computer. I I put my mask on. And I get ready to Hello, get computer. <laughs> So um yeah you're you're able to get uh that basically he he rents the apartment um it's upstairs and to the right mm -hmm. um you find that uh he lives alone uh seems like we've got a we've got a loner so you should be good um 
All right. Do you want me to come with? Sure. All right. Can do. Uh, Frodo. What's up? Um, and I initiate our secret handshake that we have to come up with later. <laughs> oh set God, your yeah. set your cannons to his apartment. Get ready to <laughs> blow it up if we have to. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> and I get out of the car and I go. Yeah, I follow. So you pop the uh, you pop the laser turret up, right? Uh, it's at six o'clock. It's six thirty in the morning on on a, on a, city, it, on a, it is, a busy street. It, it is eight thirty a.m. Saturday in a residential neighborhood. Oh, can you oh, turn no. all the cameras away? No. no. I mean, the ones that will like go by. You know what? Forget and... it. It's fine. Yeah. I have a mask on. We're okay. And I, I go. So you're wearing a gas uh, mask. And... Eight thirty a.m. in the middle mask. of the... <laughs> no, feedback. Yeah, what are you wearing? What am I wearing? Yeah. Are you wearing uh, like a gas mask or something? Or no, I'm just I'm just wearing like a probably like a black hoodie and jeans. I'm I'm not wearing my dress blues, so I'm dressed like your average I'm, civilian. I'm pretty sure I've stolen someone's ballistics mask at some point. So, so, I'm, I'm a loot goblin, so <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've stolen a dead yes. man's mask before. I think you uh, did. <laughs> yeah. So I I just, you stole the whole group a, a bunch of masks at one point. Oh yeah, I did helmets too. Yeah. And, and, and fortunately, the 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 uh, the hoodie you're wearing does not have army bla- emblazoned across it. Right, right. <laughs> yeah, I think it's it probably says stuffer shack. <laughs> okay, so um, uh, one of you one of you grab the the ninety seven, and then uh, I give them both a can mushi, uh, and then uh, they before they jump out of the car or jump out of the truck. Okay. Yeah. So as we're planning what apparently is going to be an assault on this place, uh, we're I mean, approaching... I thought we were just going to knock on the door, but yeah, sure. <laughs> I mean, you're going to knock on the door. I'm going to climb well, through a window. Well, while we square this away, uh, we're at the midpoint of our session, so we'll go ahead and take our 10-minute break uh, before the inevitable initiative rolling. <laughs> It'll be fine. So we'll be back in 10 minutes. <laughs> And welcome back, everybody. Uh, we they they've now blown the mission. Um, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, they're they're about to. Uh, I think there's some plan in formation for uh, some sort of entry into this apartment. Uh, so yeah. on the map here, uh, you'll see it's there's a door on the right that is the the door you think it is. So I... what is your what is your approach? I see a bar. You see a bar? Mm-hmm. Yeah, the, oh, on the... my bad. Uh, that's what I get for not moving the player's flag to the map. Roll 20 yeah. user error. Okay, so this is the door I'm pointing at on the right-hand side. Okay. I've intentionally blacked out most of it because you haven't seen the inside yet. Mm-hmm. Um, I can't move my token. Oh, that's unfortunate because I so can now I have I put a new token out. Well, if you put a new token out, awesome. Now you have to shrink the token. But I'm big. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Aw. <laughs> I'm not big anymore. Oh, you know what? Okay, you go up there to his room. Or, yep, distract him. And then I'm going to go. Oh, look, a fire escape. I'm going to go up the fire escape. Okay, did you say, uh, Bob, you said it was it was this one? No. It's this one. Okay. I'm going to. I'm going to go. I think Fee's going to stand there. And it's like. So you guys, so you go up the fire escape. And you go up the stairs to. I stand in front of the door. Yeah. So uh, go ahead and make a perception test for me. Both of us? Just feet. Oh, me. Okay. 
Yeah, I can do that. Um. I have plenty of dice in that. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Um, so you, uh, as you're going up the stairs, uh, you trip mm. and fall sort of up the stairs and you catch yourself. And then you, you look down and you realize that's a wire I just tripped over. Yeah, uh, do I still have a foot? Yeah. Cool. Uh, th thankfully, it's not monofilament wire. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I just kind of swear, and I'm like, all right, got to be on my A game. I'm trained for this. Uh, but you do see, as as the wire goes across, you do see a little blinky light. Beep, beep, beep. Mm-hmm. So I've dresses. tripped over the water wire, or I've tripped and you, that made me see the wire. You tripped on the wire. Mm. Um, I send a text to Ko. I tripped a wire. Uh, <laughs> regroup. No, no, no. Play it smooth. Just go knock on the door and ask him if he wants to donate to Girl Scouts. Did I scrape my knee a little bit? Um, do you want? Are yes. you wear, are you wearing that little armor? Uh, to scrape my knee. Yeah. Yeah, I left my this knee pads. Might, this on. might this might be an important question here in a, uh, here, in a here in a combat round or two. Uh, I guess I didn't. Okay. Um, yeah, I knock I knock on the door. Uh, make a perception test. Okay. Uh, you hear some footfalls coming toward the toward the door. There's a pause, and then the footsteps walk away. Uh, I'm going to uh, uh, drive around back this way. You can drive around back, all right. Um, I send another text. Um, refusing to answer the door, trying one last time. Um, what I'll, month is it? I tell her to be annoying about it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Um, let's see. It is, um, you know, I did say it was early 2077. Uh, we're going to call it March. It's not snowy, but it's a little cold out. It's cold enough that a hoodie is relatively comfortable. Okay. It's March. Okay. Uh... I knock on the door. Hello, in like the the daintiest little kid voice. Hello, hello. Okay. Um. Anybody home? Okay. So eventually, um. Uh, so I need to reveal things to you because the door does open. Uh, and you do see uh, Aaron Spencer is there. And he's acting, he's got bleary eyed. What, what do you want? Uh, you do see there's a trid there. Uh, the trid is on. Okay. Noted. Um, and you see, let's see, um, you see a little bit more of this. 
do I hear the Billy Berserker <laughs> add on the TV on the trip? Yes. Yes, you do. That tracks. Uh, he- hello. Coming next week. <laughs> <laughs> Is I think I think I go. Is that Billy Berserker? And I like just try to like run in. Okay, uh, so uh, while she this... does that, and while she does that, I'm gonna have the can Mushi like fall off and while the doors open and like kind of. All right. Uh, so I will need for you, uh, Fee, to make a. Uh, we'll just make that a gymnastics test. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um. And if I were to default that skill, uh, we'll call that it. That, that'll be a default to agility. Okay. Okay. Um. I'm. <laughs> I'm. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna use a nerve. Okay. Nailed it. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> he like he picks you up. Turns you around and sets you down so you're running outside. <laughs> Just like in the cartoons. <laughs> like, oh, wait, mister. Uh I have a I have a question. I'm so He closes to ask the door a little bit more. I no su- no surveys this morning. But it's really important. I, I really No, I just need to I do you know what St. Patrick's Day is? Mm. Didn't work. <laughs> I told uh, you, so, you should have cried. I mean, <laughs> like, no. So, Kay, what are you doing? Me. I'm. Hold on, let me see if I have the skills to say what I'm about to say. Um, I have it, don't I? Yeah, come on. Where'd it go? Okay, there it is. Um, yeah, I'm going to scale around the side and peep through his windows like a little perv. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Uh, so you scale around the sides. Yeah, while well, that's happening. I peep in the um, window. What do I see? Make a perception test. Uh, the shades are drawn. Uh, I will use an herb. Okay. Yeah, the, sh- the shades are drawn uh, too much for you to see through that window. Okay, uh, next, next window. So, so as you go to the next window, uh, you do see... Um, this one, is, th- these blinds are drawn as well, but uh, not quite as thoroughly as the other ones are. Uh, so you do see a sort of a living room, dining room combo. And there is someone sitting on the couch watching Trid. Uh, and by now, he has rolled back in. And... How, how so as you is the back? through... Um, do I see him come back in? Yeah, you see him come back in. Oh, I drop down. Okay. Like a like a. How accessible is the back? back? Like a yeah, do is is the car in full view of a? Uh, it's a, this is the street like I'm on like an alleyway or is it like an actual? Yeah, it's like an alleyway. So if okay. if someone were to look out the window, they would see your car. That's fine. Uh, he's going to back up towards uh, KO. Uh, actually, yeah, actually, where his car is right now is actually pretty good. Never mind. Oh, you like it there? I was gonna say like yeah, like the back is at this line right here, so they can't just look out this window and see my car. You know what I'm saying? All right. Uh, I'm missing my coordinates. The fee in the but like I'm, we're, we're just around the back. Yeah, you sure go like the long way. And uh, he walks through that through that door. 
Um, this door right here. The store right another, here. Is this another apartment? Yes. I'm gonna. Mm, I'm gonna go knock on that door. All right. And I have a Ken Mushi in here, right? So, I'd like to have it like mm -hmm. scuttle into this room. Uh, so there, uh, you'll see. Um, you're not seeing much because there's not much light coming in, but that's a closet. Okay. Uh, are they, uh, there's are they saying anything? Sorry. Mm -hmm. Um, you hear? Uh, actually, make a make a clear sight plus, plus pilot check. Pilot plus six. So that should not be a pilot plus reaction test. You're rolling for the drone, a number of dice equal to its pilot program okay. and its clear sight program. Oh, okay. Uh... Can Mushi doesn't have a stat block for me to you for me to doesn't use. Uh, At least not from the sheet I have. I have bio and info, but I don't. Oh, because yeah, okay. That's unfortunate. Um because I haven't set <sighs> Try it now. You may have to close it and reopen it. Um, I have to go through and set all these. I forgot to set all these so that you can control them. Gotcha. Okay. So then. Grab sugar interface. Okay. Oh, pilot plus nine D6. Great. Okay, so you should be able to control all those now. All right, so. It hears some whispering, but you're not able to make out what it is. Uh, and then you definitely hear some footsteps from this door. Uh, you're still rolling is Allerton, for the record. Allerton is in all of us, uh, I guess. Uh, here we go. Uh, what are the other two of you doing in the meantime? Uh, so he, I... there's no answer at that door? That's okay. fine. I now head around to the car. I just wanted yeah. there to be that, like... Okay, if I'm going house to house, it should seem like I'm going house to house. Okay. I'm going to. So you to, go back to the car. I'm going to meet her at the car. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Um. So as you peek in, uh, a couple of things are going to happen here. You do see uh, the bedroom. Uh, you also see... Uh, hang on a second. <laughs> I 
I don't like that. <laughs> that was that's such a good pout. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so you see her come to the bedroom. So this just is another door? Yep. So it looks like a closet door. Uh, can the Kambushi, like, squeeze under there? Uh, yeah. <laughs> and a squeeze and it goes. So there's so no, there's no other door. Uh, hey, uh, V. Huh? Is Aaron like a magician? So you do see, uh, this other woman comes in. Oh, check this out! Check this out! And then he just pulls up the the feed and puts it on everybody's. And because she she apparently hasn't seen the Kamushi yet, uh, she goes over here and pushes pulls open a uh, secret door and slides through. Uh, into the breach, the Kamushi goes. Uh, so I will ask you to make a um, a pilot plus maneuver program for the Kamushi. Because this is more more uh, more sealed than the closet doors are. Sounds good. So you said uh, pilot plus maneuver. Yes. Which is probably in the area of six dice. Uh, so it does not make it through in time. Uh, it almost makes it, but the the door does close close it out. No. But okay. um, uh, Frodo, does this mean there's no one in either the bedroom or the living room anymore? Correct. Uh, Ko, do with that what you will. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna crawl back up. Okay. Climb back up. I'm scaled aside on the building. I'm gonna peep through these windows on my way over. So uh you do see at this point, uh I'll just remove all of the oh. uh I think I can do that from no. There. Now you should be able to see the whole map. Mm -hmm. uh, you see, uh, you see Aaron Spencer headed toward the door, toward the front door of that apartment. Uh, you see uh, oh. Laura there. You see, uh, there's a larger character. Jason Hardison. Cool. Oh, yeah. I want to be friends with them. Right? Uh, and he is carrying the deck uh, as if he is active with it. Mm. Is it possible to hack that deck? Uh, it is possible. Okay. Uh, it appears to be running silent, so you'd have to actually detect the icon. Okay. Uh, and Would you I... see, you see okay. Dysel here, who is... Uh, jumping out the window. So she like jumps out, flips up and grabs the uh grabs the roof and does this sort of tuck and roll over the onto the roof. Uh-oh. I drop down immediately. <laughs> and then I rush to the front. Uh, so let's see. Uh, now we're going to go to initiative because oh. I've held I've held off with that too long. No, <laughs> it's 
to let me get to the door and knock. <laughs> I already knocked on that door. No one answered. I know. You may go ahead and roll initiative. F. Oh, you get to click, click your tokens. tokens. Click your token. It's like we're twins. <laughs> wow. Wait. <laughs> wow. Can I do matrix initiative? Uh, you can. Um, I'm drunk in my truck. So uh, are you in the car? Can I be? Uh, so if you're in the car, you can slump over and go full VR. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Or you can roll AR initiative and still be conscious. Um, I'm going to get in the car and go full VR. Um, so we'll go BB monitor. We'll go... Who am I missing? Armor. And... All right. Oh, they had a spirit this whole time? <laughs> uh, you have not seen the spirit. Okay. Which is why I just now put it on the map. <laughs> no. uh, I put it on the map because I need to roll initiative for it. Okay. So... Uh, Dysel's first. Um, need to make a perception check for her. Okay. And then what else does she do? Yeah. I'll drop an edge on that. Perfect. Oh, uh. So everything in that box there. I did. So I get to do my matrix initiative. Oh, yes, you did. So go um, click, click oh, your token. This and, button. Yeah, click your token and hit matrix initiative. Okay. Click. Nice. That's so much okay. better. We'll move you up to there. Um, so you see a, a grenade fly over toward the vehicle. That's fine. Just and it explodes no into uh, smoke. Oh, okay. <laughs> and uh, you do, uh, because you have thermographic vision, you recognize it as thermal smoke. Okay. Um, but you don't quite see where it comes from. Uh, let's see, we'll do skipping that. Okay. So, Fee. Uh, yeah, I guess. Our main priority is getting 
the gadget that this guy has the com mm -hmm. the uh cy is it a cyber deck it's a cyber deck okay so that's the main thing is getting that cyber deck but to do so this this person is a problem um so um i want to find them in the matrix and uh do do the fighting Okay, uh, so go ahead and do a uh, matrix perception. All right. Mm. You do not sense any icons other than your own. Well, that's disturbing. Cool, cool, cool. Um, mm, so that is a I'm, that is a complex action. What if do. I uh, <laughs> what if I uh, burn an edge to reroll my failures? <laughs> no, never mind. I have a limit of nine. That won't help me. Yeah. Yeah, because it right. is it is limited by your data processing attribute. Uh, my data processing attribute is three. Oh, that's the one that you, you have currently at the lowest one. Oh, I can make it eight. Or I can make it, hold on. I can switch uh, these around. So you could, you can switch them around. So as a simple action, uh, you'll have to do this, your next action. Uh, but as a simple action, you can switch any two. Okay. As a complex action, you can fully reconfigure the entire array. Okay. Cool. Uh, but that will bring us to Hardison. It's running out the door. I love how crisp his lineup is. <laughs> and he's uh, he's bolting down the stairs. He's and he's the one that's actually carrying the package, right? He is or carrying is the package, yes. Okay. Uh Spencer pops out, looks around, and sees someone. Uh, so, KO, you're going to need a defense roll. Uh, I need to pull up his... There's his stat. Here we go. Oh, boy. So I have six hits on you. I would like to use an edge to reroll okay. my fails. Okay, I was I was waiting to see if you were going to use something. Uh, yeah, so go ahead and roll six dice. Nice. Those are both painfully average rolls. Okay. Uh, so with that, uh, you are still hit. Uh, so you get to soak nine stun. You get to. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really like that phrase. <laughs> uh, I can, I, can I respond to being shot? Uh, respond how? Verbally, like... Hey, you shot me. Uh, yeah, so you can say something. Uh, hey, you okay. shot me. Who are you? Uh, so, okay, so, uh, in, in point of fact, he just punched you. Oh, he punched me? Oh, I thought yeah. he... Yeah, he's, he's just... Heard a gun in my head. Hey! 
I'm a lady. <laughs> <laughs> and that was the quote of the night. <laughs> yeah. This hey. last episode, I knocked yeah, out a lady. dude. Why'd you hit me? Frodo. Uh, so hearing that come over comms, uh, Frodo is actually going to deploy the, the cannon, and he is actually going to start acquiring targets from Ko's uh, Kamushi that she has on her shoulder. Oh my god, I've got bugs on my shoulder. You do? Ooh, great. So uh, I think I need to do uh, air sight plus piloting, right? Uh, the Kamushi pilot. So who are you trying to acquire? Uh, well, I guess I, I guess Frodo wouldn't actually know that he's one carrying the package, right? So, so go ahead and make go ahead and make a clear go ahead and make the clear side plus pilot check. So that's six dice. And I think you heard KO say over comms, the big guy has the deck or something similar. Because I think KO is the one that took a look inside. Yeah. So uh, you're kind of mushy. You can see, of course, there's uh, there's Aaron Spencer who's in melee with KO. Uh, you can see the uh, the guy with the deck uh, who is a new target to you. And that's about all you can see from that viewpoint. Okay, well, uh... He's gonna try to take out Hardison and not... No, yeah, he's gonna try to take out Hardison, I guess, with the with the cannon. All right, uh, let's see here. Uh, let me see what... Let me make sure what Thermal Smoke does. Because I have no idea what that does. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Um, H174. Okay. So it's the same as fog. So that does make a difference for your laser. Uh, so you know that uh, shooting through the thermal smoke is going to decrease the damage of your weapon. La lasers don't like to shoot through fog yeah. or smoke. Okay. Uh, but go ahead and, uh, I mean, you can take the shot. Oh, yeah, I'll take a smackdown. Uh, understanding that you are, you are attempting to shoot through a house. <laughs> yes. And even though it's a heavy laser... Uh, you may you may not get as awesome results as you hope. Okay. So you use a smackdown. Uh, so let's go ahead and we'll throw the button so I see the damage everything there. Okay. Uh, so it's smackdown. Um, So the damage is actually going to be reduced by two. So it's eight P, AP minus ten, and uh, we'll say the minus ten is basically the house. Okay. So he'll do a regular soak roll against eight P. Ready. Uh, I'll throw an edge on that. Uh, so he takes no damage. Boo! Boo! <laughs> <laughs> you, you hit him with the laser and he just, he takes it. Ah, okay. But But to be fair, it's pretty weak after shooting through a house. <laughs> That's what... And he's kind I'll of a big guy. Get your logic out of here. <laughs> uh -huh. 
Um, okay. So So, I'm going to just return the favor, and I'm going to knock his lights out. Um, okay. So, yeah, that'll be... Unarmed strike, I guess? I'm going to use my killing hands and um, penetrating strike, etc. Look at that real quick. Up, I get that. Okay, it's going to be physical damage. Bloop, bloop, bloop. And I'm going to use a... Derp. Okay. And... There we go. I'll use a smackdown. He dodges what you're throwing at him. Why? He hit me. And I scream. So rude. <laughs> so rude. All right, so. We're at the top of the second pass. Well, I guess I have movement, so I guess I'm going to just freaking move away. Uh, he will attempt to intercept you. Why am I getting pooped on, Bob? Uh, so that costs him five to his initiative score. And well, if he's gonna chase me down, I'm gonna scream, "You little pervert!" <laughs> what is with Ko? What's with this guy? Oh, the, the real Ko is coming out. He just like sees me on the street, punches me. Well, I didn't do anything. Uh, so you need to make a defense roll. I'm gonna die today. <laughs> okay, at the end of this, uh, we'll wake up and it was just a dream. Yeah, okay. Still in the holler. So you are hit. Uh, so that'll be 12S. I'm just going to... So that maxes out my stun damage track. One. Well, well you still and need to soak. Oh. Great. But you're, you're soaking 12 S. Soaking 12 S? Jesus. Where's the soak button? There it is. Oh my god. Use one of your 13 smackdowns. Oh, that's a pretty good roll there. Use one of your Bob, I will have my vengeance. Smackdowns. You just watch out, that's okay? so funny. <laughs> you, take two, you take two boxes of stun, uh, but because you did not take damage exceeding your body, you still get to move. Okay, and then I, after I call him a little pervert, <laughs> I run away okay. <laughs> and say, stay away from me. Hey, guys, mm -hmm. just so you know, before, I didn't think you'd blown the run. But for the record, yeah, this is where you blow, you've blown the run. Thanks for the encouragement. 
You won't. Thanks. In my head. Thanks. Um, thanks. um, and then I say, stay away from me and my little cousin. <laughs> Cute. That was the other plan. I was gonna just go up there and be like, um, did my little cousin come up here and bother you? Sorry. And apologize for it, but that never happened, so <laughs> shoot him dead, Chris. Shoot him dead. Those, Blow it all up. They all vanish from view. Uh. Ah, okay. Hmm. Hey. I want to try to find them in the Matrix again, but I'm going to use a Smackdown this time. Okay, Smackdown will do it. Uh, you do find their, uh, you do find a matrix signature for, uh, for Jason Hardison. Uh, he is basically right where I left him. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, but you now, you now see the icon. Amazing. Uh, so on your, on your next turn, you can do something with that. Cool. Was that a major action? That that is a uh, complex action. Okay, so, so I can't do turn. anything else. Nope. Good. Okay. Ferdo. Uh, so he is going to uh, uh turn on some uh some high energy music and he's gonna peel out of the smoke. Okay. Oh uh, no! Like for some, the first one that came to my mind was like smack the bitch up. <laughs> Like, okay. Like, I, for some now. reason, I don't know what the prodigy or whatever it is, whoever did that, like, uh, came into my mind, and he's like, uh, and he's gonna drive around the corner. I mean, yeah, I'll, I guess I could just drive <laughs> to the, the living room. room. <laughs> yeah, no, that makes sense to me. <laughs> I'll essentially yeah. make it as far around here as you'll let me. Okay, you, you get in the car? Is that what I'm seeing? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I uh, just get in the car. Alrighty. Uh... I tell KO to, to grab the ninety seven and slap it on the uh, on the outside of the on of the door. <laughs> I do it, and then I say they're not here anymore. I mean, they gotta be here. Uh, they like they did just disappear. You're muted. <laughs> just, just said they went bye bye basically. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so it is your turn again, Fee. Okay. Um, the last action of the combat turn. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll. I can see Jason Hard Hardison, right? You can see the icon uh, corresponding to the deck. To the deck. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I. So, so one thing you can do. Um, I mean, you can you can either try to attack it, or you can try to track it. I need it to be in one piece. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna track it. Okay. Um, I have track. So it is a uh, trace icon. Um. Track program keeps an eye on your targets for you, making it easier to find their meat world equivalents. Oh, so that doesn't work for that. Hang on. Uh, let me see what you're referring to here.
Yeah, so it, so it, so it modifies it, it modifies uh, your your trace icon action. Okay. Yeah, I want to I want to do the trace thing. I want I want a trace user. Okay. Uh, so this will add two to your data processing, which is what you kind of wanted to do, uh, because your data processing currently is only three. Mm -hmm. Now it's five. Okay. So go ahead and roll. That's a uh, computer plus intuition. Uh, with no modifiers, right? Or with with no modifiers. Okay. Mm. <sighs> Sad. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so I'll let, I'll let you do that. Okay. Since this is your first mission playing a Decker. Okay. So that's three more dice. So you'd, you would just hit the edge button and reroll the whole thing. Oh. So turn on, turn on the edge button on your. Uh, it should be at the top of the character sheet. Yeah. Because you're, you're going to pre edge it. And then, and then roll, roll the computer. Mm hmm. Okay. Interesting. Uh, there. Oh. And I will re-roll that. Oh, cute. Yay. So re-roll the entire test. We did it. Um, so you think you have a a trace on the deck. Uh just as you hear a van speeding away. Mm hmm and and your 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 tracked icon is moving with that van. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, so this as we, is where it gets fun. Yeah. So so uh, as we're getting close to the ten o'clock hour, <laughs> all uh, according to plan. All according to plan. <laughs> uh, we'll pick up next week with what is potentially a car chase. Oh yeah. <laughs> potentially, this, yeah. <laughs> or, or potentially just the the rigor lasering the van. Into nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Call Michael Bay. This is going to be great. <laughs> Get the next episode directed by Michael Bay. <laughs> uh, so we'll pick up there next time. Uh, let's see. So uh, thank you, everybody, for joining. Uh, thank you. I saw, some, I saw some gifts in the chat. Thank you for all of those. I uh, hope you guys are tracking your gifts, because I am not. I'm certainly tracking the ones that I've spent, so i got to go back through and edit my, yeah. my Benny sheet. Um, so does anybody have any announcements they want to they wanna make before we end? Uh, let's say, uh, you guys. Yeah, have a safe holiday weekend. Yes, we're coming up on the holiday weekend. Be safe. Yeah, be smart. Um, uh, join us on Gen Con TV on Thursday night, uh, where I'm going to run Shadowrun 6. Yes, yeah, another opportunity to bully me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> why am I getting Thanks, pooped Bob. on, Bob? Yeah, why am I getting pooped on, Bob? I'm just a lady. <laughs> you roll a die and... <laughs> so, so on that note, uh, thank you, everybody, for joining us. Uh, thank you to the players for... Distracting me the entire session. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, uh, th thanks, not. Tom, for uh, for doing tech, uh, thanks, holding Tom. everything together. Thanks, Tom. Much love, my bro. We'll see you next time. <laughs>